We're in the home stretch of Christmas. It's only a week away. Let's see what we got here. I'm getting better at this stuff. That sidecar yesterday was the best cocktail I've had so far. Um, so looking forward to today. And today we have the Journeyman Distillery Old Country Goodness. It's a secret family recipe. This is an apple cider liqueur. And they this is only 10% alcohol, 20 proof. This says it's best served cold or hot. I might actually be able to drink this just by itself. Um, and it actually, they um, you can see there's little bits of apple still floating in here. They tell you to shake it well. So um, yeah, might drink this by itself, might make a shot. All right, today I'm going to make an apple pie shot. All the reindeers do one of these before the big night to get them ready ready to go. So we're gonna take our um, apple cider liqueur. We're gonna pour it into our shaker here. I'm gonna give this a smell. Ooh, oh my gosh, that smells like fresh picked uh, Michigan apples. Oh, that is real nice. Oh, now I feel bad putting other stuff in it. Oh, and the camera person told me to take a sip, so I'll take a sip. Oh, oh, that it, you know what? I don't even know if I need to do all this. This can be enjoyed on its own, it's low proof. Oh, this will warm you up on a cold night. And it's delicious cold, but I bet it's even better hot. Wow, all right. Well, that's it, then I don't need to do all this stuff here. Well, I guess I could do it, I got it. I took the time to get all this stuff out. Um, for the apple pie shot, we have our apple um, cider liqueur, man, that's good. And then um, all the flavored ones have been good. Like this one, the coffee one, the humdinger jalapeno spirit, all good. Um, but I'm gonna mix this with uh, some um, third degree cinnamon flavored whiskey. And this comes from a local distillery here in Indianapolis, West Fork. So I'm combining the two local distilleries here, I'm gonna put what do you say? One shot? Two shot? One? All right. Pour that in there. Now it's... Oh, man, now it's got a real cinnamony flavor to it. West Fork, they, uh, they're located, they have a, the Mash House in Westfield. And then I think they still have their location on uh, 17th Street in Bella Fontaine. Um, they do a lot of great cocktails there. Um, and most of their whiskeys are corn based because you know, it's Indiana, right? So then we're gonna put in a splash of apple cider here, just to tie everything together. Yeah, that looks good. All right. Oh, we're gonna shake all this up here. Pour it into my shot glasses here. We got Sonic the Hedgehog. We got one from the Hemingway House down in Key West. I tried some rum there. It was delicious. And then we got uh, a Hamilton inspired one. So there you go. On, on Thanksgiving, we like to uh, watch Hamilton. It's a uh, household tradition here. Helps us stay awake after all that food. And I don't know why I'm pouring all three of these shots. I don't know who's going to do these shots, but I guess I am. All right. Bottoms up. Ah, tastes... Ooh, that is delicious. Tastes like apples, and you get a little bit of that cinnamon there, just up on the tip of your tongue. Well, that's good. I'm going to do another one. Let's do another one. Mmm. Ah. Got more of the cinnamon whiskey in that one. That was good. Man, this is delicious. I, why, don't, why don't we just do a third one, right? Let's go. Mmm. I swear, it just, it just keep getting better. Why don't, we, why, why don't we just run this back? Why don't we run, why, line up another one? We got all this here, right? Let's go, four. Mmm. I should mention it's a weeknight. 
and I do have to work tomorrow, and I still need to make dinner, but now yeah, let's do a fifth one here. These are, like, this was only 10%, or it was only, yeah, it was only 35%. This is low, this is low stuff, easy. Mm. Okay, I am going to call it there, though, so apple pie shots.